Dressed in Halloween costumes terrify a Rowan County couple. One of the victims spoke exclusively with News Channel 36 reporter Alex Reed. He took our mobile newsroom to Rowan County to hear their frightening story. If you don't open that safe, I'm going to blow your damn head off. Sherry Dedman told me quite a story. She says she woke up from a nap to find a 12-gauge shotgun pointed at her face. He punched his gun. He says, I'm not picking you. And, he wanted uh, money. He grabbed me by my arm and he dragged me to the safe. As a guy and a girl ransacked the home for anything valuable, Sherry saw a chance to run out the back door. He hit me on, the, on this side of the jaw. But when she made it outside, she was hit by a third suspect who had been holding her husband at gunpoint on the back lawn. It, it was swollen for a while. The victims didn't get a good look at any of the suspects because they were wearing Halloween masks like these. What they did get was one of the suspects names. Investigators have now confirmed her name is Stephanie. It's scary. It's scary to us. Police and neighbors tell me nothing like this has ever happened here. That's cold. That's just that's cold hearted and cruel. Eventually, the masked suspects left, leaving the injured couple alive. I was praying. I didn't care who heard me. I was saying hallelujah. Investigators are asking anyone with information about Stephanie, the other two suspects, or their dark colored pickup truck to call the Rowan County Sheriff's Department. With our mobile newsroom in Rowan County, Alex Reed, News Channel 36.